Hello everyone, my name is Rama Somatur here today with the Yokogawa Corporation of America. And today we'll be briefly overviewing the base screen navigation capabilities of the GXGP data recorders. Um, to simplify this overview, let's first understand that the GXGP data recorders are devices that take in a variety of inputs to measure industrial field parameters such as temperature, pressure, flow, and so on. Then the recorders are able to display the measured data through different graphical mediums. As we can see displayed right here, this trend display is continuously recording live temperature data from a couple of thermocouple field inputs connected to the analog input module on the back of the unit. This trend thus graphs the varying temperature values over time. One of the features of the trend graph of the GX allows the user to seamlessly scroll to the recent trend history by simply swiping the trend to the right as such. Here, you will see a date and timestamp that will allow you to keep track of where in the historical records you currently are. If you notice on the right hand side of the display, the individual input channels are listed with the live feed measurement readings coming from the field inputs. Right now, since we only have one input, one thermocouple input, you will see one digital display reading that is live and that changes over time. You can add multiple channel displays depending on the different field inputs connected to your data recorders. While we're on the trend display, on the left side of each display, there's a quick access menu that allows an operator to be able to smoothly jump to different points of a trend history, such as at the beginning, middle, or end. You simply drag this box and place it at the different historic location you would like to view. Additionally, an operator can add messages directly to the display and also freehand draw messages pertaining to different messages they would like to input, such as if I'd like to examine this particular section of data, I can simply add a note telling another operator to review or leave it there so that when I'm reviewing this historic data, I'm able to look at the section and review it in detail because I left the note. Now, if you would only like to view these live channel readings on the right, simply go to Menu, Browse, and select Bar to make the GX display the measurements in bar graph form. You can get a visual gauge for how the measurements are changing over time through the level of each bar graph. Additionally, going into the browse menu and selecting the digital display is another way for an operator to read instantaneous temperature or pressure or any field parameter measurements. One unique feature of the GX GP data recorders are that they allow one display screen to house multiple smaller trends or graphs in a custom layout tailored to the preferences of the operator. Simply go to Browse, select Multi-Panel, and now you're able to view the trend, digital display bar graph, and the overview all in one screen. An operator is able to customize the way these displays look via a settings menu. There are a lot more display options to configure on the GX. Uh, please take your time to explore these settings to get a comprehensive grasp on the GX data recorder's display features.